Hello and welcome to Dog Days Resort Pitch Deck, created by Stacy Mosley, Cassidy Fountain, Shaniqua Smith, and Terika Brady and Magdalene Smith. In this next slide, we'll be talking about the key problems and the needs that this concept will solve or address. Here, we are helping to solve the problem of dog owners having to leave their beloved pets, and some of us say children, with a sitter or have to board their pets when they go on vacation. Many pet owners have anxiety about leaving their pets. Also, we want to offer their dog more than just a walk in the park. In slide three, we're going to explain how we solved the problem that was identified in slide two and also address the needs of our products and services. Dog Days Resorts gives the pups and their owners a peace of mind. The resort includes hotel accommodations, spas, restaurants, classes for dogs and their owners, and a theme park. The theme park is custom made for dogs and the dog owners to enjoy together. In slide four, it asks, what is your actual offering? Dog Day Resort takes dogs and their owners' bonding time to another level. The resort wants to give dog owners and dog lovers an opportunity to do things normal places do not allow them to do with their dog. We want to offer a place for fun and relaxation for everyone. We want everyone to feel comfortable and secure. We want the dogs and their owners to experience things they've never experienced to book for together. We want the, this resort to be their go-to place for vacations. We have a variety of entertainment and dog owners do not have to leave their dogs behind to experience it. A place where they can grow and learn from each other in a different light. We want to offer a home away from home. Addressing question number five of the opportunity analysis, who are our key customers, users, and stakeholders? So our target customers are dog owners, more specifically people who have pure breeds, show breeds, and adopted dogs. We are also targeting um, people who do not have a dog, but um, would maybe want to get one now that we have this resort. And a survey was sent out by Dog Days Resorts um, that showed that people did not have dogs, but loved them and were very interested in visiting. Regarding what is our value proposition, the value that we are creating for our customers is a dog-friendly environment where dogs can be brought along on family vacations. We offer relaxation for both dogs and dog owners with our special spa services. Our restaurants offer healthy and delicious food for both dogs and their owners. Dog days offer fun and entertainment with our state of the or a theme park and a variety of classes. Dog Days Resorts is a home away from home. Referencing to question six, which asks, what is the competitive positioning of your concept? Our competitive position is, is that there is no resort like Dog Days Resorts in the Southern United States. Our closest competitor is Bow Wow Boutique. Bow Wow Boutique offers spa and grooming packages homemade treats for dogs, daycare, and boarding packages. Bow Wow Boutique, however, does not have hotel accommodations or a theme park. Dog Days Resorts has the advantage of offering these extra accommodations to our clients. There are resorts that are like Dog Days in the northern part of the United States. For example, the resort at Paws Up, located in Montana. Dogs are provided with dog food, dog dish, collar, treats, and tennis balls. Paws Up charges $50 per night pet fee. Dog Days Resorts does not charge a pet fee. Dog Days Resorts has resources that fit into the VRIO framework. Our most valuable resources are our accommodation for both dog and dog owners. They include a dog-friendly hotel and a theme park. There are our valuable, these are our valuable resources because most pet owners love spending quality time with their dogs and this is one of the only places that they can do this. Our resources are very rare because our dog-friendly 
the hotel is complimentary and our theme park has both dog and dog owner features. This is the top place to spend time with your dog. And there are no other dog friendly resorts like Dog Days Resort. Dog Days Resorts offer complimentary stays with our members stays when our members are visiting and this is because our money is made through our memberships our restaurant spa service and merchandise as well as other offers we give at the resort our company believes that our purpose of creating dog days resorts is a lifetime pursuit and we would like to develop more day by day Number seven and eight of our opportunity analysis for Dog Days Resort. Um, number seven, how big is our potential market? Our potential market for the state of Mississippi is $221 million. Um, how much of market share is already taken? A, a big part of that is already taken, but our biggest five um, actors, I guess, with this, market is pet products at 135.8 million veterinary services 135 million pet foods marketing uh and manufacturing is 388 million that's a big big jump um pet services 30.4 million pet sales 19.8 million what is the mar market growth like um state projecting for future potential um the future potential is expected to continue to grow. Uh, a little uneasy in this COVID kind of nation that we've got going on here. Um, the expected growth in the state is 499.2 million. Um, people love animals. They're, they're, you know, that's their companions. A lot of us, that is our best friends, our family. That's all we have. Um, Number eight, um, what is revenue income model and brief for Dog Days Resort? Well, our usage fees are main sor sources of revenue for Dog Days Resorts. Uh, revenues will come from added amenities such as restaurants, resort merchandise, pot spa services in the hotel or the resort. We have added a couple of different ideas that we would, that would allow for an increase in class flow. Um, hosting festivals, uh, dog shows like AKC, um, you know, we've charged an entry fee. Also creating a brand exclusively for the resort um, that would involve um, a lot of, you know, revenue stream flow there. We can sell it like gas stations, pet stores, pet food companies. Um, convince um, our customers for a membership, yearly membership fee. Um, is this concept desirable, feasible, or viable as a startup? Our company believes that this is a desirable concept. A lot of people love dogs. Um, but looking at the numbers required to start this resort, we do not consider a dog days resort as a feasible as a startup. Uh, we do, however, think that it is a viable concept of partners. If we could get partners of a considerable wealth could be attained to start the project. Major constraints are funding. Um, startup this type it would take millions um, of dollars. Uh, the proposed business concepts would only be considered desirable, feasible if we had a trusted partner that had a lot of money. <laughs> but we, we, love, we love this idea. So. Thank you for listening.